we still at the Barker Mansion. I mean, it's a gigantic place, 38 rooms, I believe something like 35,000 yes. square feet. I mean, it's huge. You could get lost in here. This is a library, it looks like. A lot of books. Yes, this is the library. And uh, this is Jessica, who is the director here, and TJ, who is the heritage interpreter. Uh, so if you guys want to talk for a little bit, we know that you're having an event coming up on the 10th of February from 3 to 6 p.m. What, what, can you tell us more about that? Sure. Well, the event is in partnership with Steve and Mary E. We are celebrating the 125th wedding anniversary of John and Catherine Barker, so it's a very, very special occasion. Interesting. They have a fantastic love story, and of course they were the premier couple in Michigan City, and I would argue Northwest Indiana, wow. maybe even venturing mm. into Chicago, mm. being the top of the top. So having a big party here for their wedding anniversary and celebrating in style, just like they would have done way back when. Fun afternoon. Sure is. Uh, Zorn Brew Works will be here with appetizers and uh, beer and wine. So, uh, you know, it's going to be a nice little uh, loose kind of atmosphere for a Victorian romance. You know, if you think about the word Victorian, sometimes that conjures up, you know, very tight clothing and such. But uh, no, it's going to be a fun, loose time. We're going to have great music here. We're bringing David Lam along, who's a, you know, an accomplished and renowned pianist. Uh, so I think it's a great way to kick off basically the the uh, Valentine's Day period. So, yeah, um, if, you've, if you've never been to Barker Mansion, it's a great opportunity to check it out. Sure, and it, you know coincides with the wedding of John and Catherine Barker. Uh, so TJ, is there anything you uh, want to talk about? How wonderful it is oh. that we can, uh, you know, be talking about that and remembering it. Yeah, it's there. They had a very unique marriage. Uh, I mean, coming up is their 125th wedding anniversary. Right. They, uh, originally met in 1890, um, 1891, when uh, Catherine uh, went to teach at Barker Hall, a school that John had built over on Franklin Street. Oh um, wow! Part of the building still stands today. And her parents actually came over. Um, were Irish immigrants came over during the potato famine. Uh -huh. the, uh, and you know her father actually was a stonecutter in a quarry in New Hampshire at the time. He's working class, and his daughter, two years after she moved out here, ended up marrying one of the wealthiest industrialists in the Midwest. He had an estate worth of over sixty million dollars by 1910, and a lot of the Barker Mansion that we see today is actually all Catherine um, Fitzgerald Barker's. That's I mean, it's all her taste and design. She worked with the architect on all of this. Um, her husband's names actually really only appear on the contracts and the checks for the architect. She had, this is almost we'll see we see her this week all throughout the Barker Mansion. Wow. That sounds like a nice way to divide the, uh, you know, the brilliance and the, the muscle behind it, so interesting. Um, anything else coming to mind on the theme of this wonderful event we're going to be having? Let me just add one more time, February 10th, which is a Saturday, from 3 to 6 p.m. and we're, uh, the, the mansion is located at the corner of 7th and Washington Street, right here in Michigan City.